So I wanted to ask you also about um, the screens that we tried out yesterday. Yes. I'm uh, quite funny. I was just looking for them. <laughs> I'm just trying to find where you put them. Well, I put them on. Um, I put them on Facebook, on our on the Wild Show Facebook page. And I've gone to your your normal place. Oh, them. okay. I'm just looking through your playlist. I will find them and have a quick look at, and um, see what you you're talking about. We're talking about colour behind a person when they're filmed? Yes. We, we, we're basically trying to work out how to turn the, the city centre into a studio, how to use it uh, to create video as an extension of radio. Because when, when the Radio 1 Academy was here, they started talking about visual radio. They seem to think that as sound becomes part of social media, it might as well be video. Mm. That's uh, that's just, that's my understanding so far. Well, the first, so the first one I've looked at was the one which um, I, when I stood in front of a black screen. Yes. And it looks like my head is popping out of this <laughs> the right at you, you know, because it's. Well, yeah, I've tried to um, use software to 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 put a, ba a different background onto you, and in that right. case, it seems to have left the background alone and put the new image in. Into it's pretty good. It's not bad, really. Yeah, because when you when I move out of shot, yeah, and I'm pointing at the screen, yeah, I go funny colour, I go white, <laughs> yes, <laughs> <laughs> as if I got some terrible disease. And I come back and then you see my rosy cheeks. So yeah, that that seems to work. That one there, that's not no, that's not too bad. So that one, just to explain, that was um, we we did talk about this last week, but I'll just repeat it for okay. new listeners yeah. that we. We understand the BHS store might be used as some sort of tech centre as part of the City Futures, Exeter City Futures. Mm. And so we, we first of all thought, well, perhaps they would have a, a green screen or a blue screen as part of that. Well, I'm looking at the blue screen now. The blue screen, but we found, we found various screens around the Exeter High Street sort of area. Well, that one to me looks like I'm floating on something. <laughs> uh, yes. yes, we have an additional problem that, that mm. the if we use the phone cameras yes. and try and edit them in desktop yeah. software, it turns it around by 90 degrees. Right. So the, that's that's why you well seem the to be floating. On, on when you've done your panning work was actually okay. Fine, but I notice you've got to do them slower. That's why I think because do the panning slower. Yeah, because it, it, it's like it's like the phone's catching up with you. Oh yes, 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 right? yes. Now yes. I'm looking at the white one. Yep. And good God, this is my French. <laughs> but I think I think you need to go and see a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> no, white a white one or the creamy white one. Yep. Um, it's okay actually. You see the whole image. So the black or the white are the pretty good ones. Yep. So we can just go and find black or white screen and say, "Stand there, please. I want to film you." <laughs> well, yes. Yeah. Yes. So, 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 so th it, the principle of it might work. Yes. If there's anybody out there who actually understands what they're doing with the software, hmm. that would that would be good. You can find them. You can find all. all the, they're all in the playlist. They're all in the YouTube playlist. Um, so you'll find that on, on a link from the Wild Show Facebook page. Yes. And so you can take the originals and try and superimpose a different background, or impose, superimpose them on a different background, I should say. Yes. And how, they, how the image in, in the front stands out to the image behind. Yes. That's, so, uh, ooh, I have to turn mine upside down for this one. 